Hey guys, my name is Tamasha Bear and welcome to the part 4 of the Fort Nightmares challenges. In this video, I'm going to tell you how you can do all the challenges in a very easy way. And before we begin this video, make sure you guys smash the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to be notified for new videos every single day. And also smash the like button and share this video with all your friends and family so that they can complete their Fort Nightmares challenges. So before we begin this video, make sure you guys watch this video till the end so that you would understand on how to do these challenges. Well, with, with that being said, let's begin today's video. So the first challenge is to destroy elite cube monsters. You need to destroy 10 of those monsters and it's a pretty easy one. Now you're going to ask me the question, what are these elite cube monsters? Well, the elite cube monsters are the monsters which is like pretty tall, slim and which glows, okay? I'm not talking about the yellow ones, the big boss ones. I'm talking about the, the glowing ones, the purple glowing ones. Those are the elite cube monsters and you need to destroy 10 of those monsters. It's pretty easy and simple and for this one you get 500 XP. This is, this is amazing, right? So in this week, we have six challenges and for completing each of those, you're gonna get 500 XP for each. So now moving over to the next one, you, you ha we have damage cube fragments. So we have 2,500 damage, which is to be dealt to those cube fragments. So the cube fragments are those structures where the zombies come out from. For completing this challenge, you get like 500 XP. So these cube fragments are spread throughout the map. And when you go to, to them, you can have your grenades, explosive weapons, or even any gun. You can take those things down and deal 2,500 damage. Moving over to the next one, which is to deal damage with Q monsters in a single match. Okay, so you need to deal damage to the Q monsters in a single match. You need to deal a damage of a thousand. Okay, how can you deal damage? Maybe if you just want to complete your challenge, let's consider the battle bus is very far away from Jung Junction. You go over there where there will like less enemies where you can have your peace of your mind and take down all the zombies you know deal 1000 damage get the job done you know like uh, like get eliminated due to fall damage go back and complete the challenges if that's your case so now moving on over to the other one which is to visit different corrupted areas in a single match now this this challenge is asked by many people like how can i do it in one single game well it's easy I have four different uh, like spots where you can hit pretty easily and do the challenges, okay? First one is in Fatal Fields, second one, Salty, third one, Shifty, fourth one, Pleasant. Now, here is the interesting thing. You can select, you know, dissect the whole map into four different parts and depending on where you land, you can start from there. Maybe if you want to go with Pleasant, you go to the Floating Island, then head over to Lazy from there, Whaling and from Whaling to Retail. So it's like four corners of the map, like you can go to either of them. One is always going to be longer than the other one. So yeah, that's my way to do it. No one's going to give you all these tips and tricks on how to do these challenges in a very fast way. This one you get 500 XP. Moving over to the next one, you need to destroy cube fragments. Okay, so we have had like dealing damage to the cube fragments. Now we have to like completely destroy the cube fragments. For this one, you get like 500 XP, cool and simple. So, use your explosive weapons, deal as much damage possible, try to save your ammunition. You know, just carry some explosive just in case if you want to destroy those cube fragments. So, you can ask your friends to go to some other cube fragments, they can take that down easily. You can destroy one thing, they can destroy one thing, everyone can ch complete their challenges in a pretty easy way. The last one is to complete all the 14 Fort Nightmares challenges. So, for this one, you get 500 XP, you need to complete 4 Nightmare challenges, 14 of those, and for this one, you get like, like, uh, 500 XP after completing all the challenges of part 1 part 2 part 3 part 4 You're gonna get a free letter if you have missed out on part 1 2 3 or 4 You know on how to complete the challenges the videos are there in the channel So if you have missed out on any you can go over there and you can see it for yourself and you know help yourself Complete all the challenges well I hope you guys can subscribe to the channel if this video helped you out for sure So once you're subscribed make sure you guys turn on the notification bell to be notified for new videos every single day well, with that being said, my name is Tamasha Bear. There will be some videos playing on the screen right now. If you want, you can go over there and you can see it for yourself. Goodbye and have a great day in Fortnite, ladies and gentlemen.